Well, hello and welcome to Fifth Vertex, a YouTube channel where anything can happen, especially me just doing my cool for a basic pop song. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for clicking and joining me in this new video. I am beyond excited because I've heard and I've seen some stuff online that got me really excited for this music video that is called Industry Baby. It's from Lil Nas X and Jack Harlow. Is that how you say his name? I think so. Jack Harlow. Yeah. It's called Industry Baby, as I said, and it looks like it's gonna have some explicit, even though censored, scenes, and it seems that it's kinda getting a lot of comments online, a lot of buzz online, and it gets me excited because we all know how Montero, that music video was amazing, so Lil Nas X really has been putting a lot of effort in his videos, and I love to see that because it's been a while since people actually put a lot of effort in their music videos, and I love to see that, so I'm very excited about this, let's see it, because I cannot wait anymore, let's go. Exciting, hitting play. Lil Nas X, I sentenced you to five years in Montero State Prison. Oh my god, it's him, right? Like the old man, it's him, right? I think so. And here it is, like, it looks so pretty. Baby, baby. No way, he's in prison with all that decoration. I didn't even know he had Grammys, does he? Oh, slay. Oh my god, like the gay culture is alive when it concerns Lil Nas X and I stand because there's literally, when I mean literally, no one that has this sort of spotlight on them doing what he's doing and I love that he's bringing like this sort of aware, I don't want to say awareness, but this sort of images to the general public so they really can get used to it because it's so normal, you know what I mean? It's so normal that people dress like this, you know what I mean? And people act like this and it's so okay, like, you know what I mean? And I feel like even though like a lot of pop stars really bring awareness to the LGBTQ plus community, there's no one that is actually in it and feels the way that we feel, you know what I mean? So this is really important. Oh. Girl, are they really naked or do they have stuff covering their things? Because, you know, they are doing a lot of movements and I can only imagine. You know, okay. I love how pink this prison is. All right, so, so far the song sounds pretty cool. Sounds like it can do its job, you know what I mean? It sounds like it's commercial enough to really please the general public and that is, that is nice. And attached to it, there's this viral video that is obviously gonna get viral. And yeah, like I really enjoy it. I, like, is 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 um, how can I say? Is machine like the machine that is behind him? Like the team is just great. They really know what they're doing, honeys. <laughs> okay, that is a nice way of exercising. I never tried that. I should try it. Ooh. I like this dun, 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 dun. like an in instrumental kind of gives like an anthemic sort of vibe you know what I mean that is nice and I think it's it it, it can be the, the 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 trigger for it to become a successful hit you know oh he's gonna be out the production the budget like out of this world oh yes Okay, that punch was not great, you know, we could totally see it's fake, but, <laughs> you know, it was, why did he punch him? It was giving you a stream. You would just stop that. Oh, we have a straight scene. That is offensive when we're like in the mood, you know what I mean? Like, what did you do? I'm kidding. Oh, whoa. Okay, this is cool, I like it. Okay, his part is a little bit long. Oh, oh, yes. Yes, he's slaying the choreo, I love it. I love how he also prioritizes choreography because, you know, it's not every day that you see a man doing it, you know what I mean? So it's really, really cool to see this. It's really, really cool to see a man doing what you would expect from a female pop star because I feel like expectations and this can be a little bit controversial but I feel like expectations when it concerns men and women are so different especially from us gay people that love pop music and pop stars and I feel like we really expect a lot from pop stars that are girls that we don't expect from men that are pop stars as well you know what I mean and it's so cool to see Lil Nas X doing extremely the maximum that he can 
to really do that, to really live up to what female pop stars do, because it's exactly what they do. They do the choreography, they do the visuals, they do the songs, they do everything, you know what I mean? They are perfect pop machines and I really am glad to see like a man stepping up and really do this, because men need to step up, you know? like they do, and Lil Nas X is really doing for the men. I love the feet game right here. And they set fire to the prison, this is so nice, this is very very cool, yeah. And the story by Lil Nas X, so that is very cool. We love to see originality comes from coming from new artists. So yay, this is pretty 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 pretty. Uh, this was pretty cool. That's what I want to say. And there was Lil Nas X with Jack Harlow for Industry Baby. You know, great great concept. Love the video. The song, you know, I prefer Montero. I have to say, like Montero was like f love at first sight. For this one, I'm gonna have to give it a keep like more attention for me to get used to it you know what i mean but it was good regardless you know what i mean it was really nice i like how anthemic it kind of is i like how soldierish it kind of sounds you know it sounds like that song when you go to do like a military service you know what i mean uh like that sort of uh, mood you know so that was really cool and well thought because in the lyrics he mentions soldiers and you can also tell that it's kind of is the inspiration behind the entire thing uh, but yeah, Montero was like a little bit more up to my taste, but visually though, it's just as iconic, you know, I love every bit of this music video, you know, it's very very iconic like Montero, love how they included Montero in this one as well, but you know, this one was great, great too, because not only, as I said, is really bringing like the things that people assume to be gay to normal, to basically to, to, to the spotlight, because you know, there's, as I said throughout the reaction, like, the pop girls, they really do the, their best to represent us, but they are not us, they are not gay, they are not men, you know what I mean? And therefore, they cannot really understand the entire thing. And here, Lil Nas X really, really does, and he's bringing that, you know, specific and unique element to the table, and I think that's so important. And it, that is also part of why I feel like the video is so iconic, because it just... It's not only about the shock value of being naked, for example, but also about the crop tops, the pink pants, you know what I mean? Everything about it, like, the, the, the hand, you know, like... Everything that people kind of look at prejudice is bringing into the spotlight. Like, watch this, like, I'm normal, so you can treat me as normal, you know what I mean? So, it really is good for him to, to, to fight against prejudice of any kind, so I'm really, really thankful for that. And I love the choreography as well. Everything about this video was great. The budget is here, the budget was on Montero as well, and I really cannot wait to see what he's gonna do, because he's really elevating it, you know what I mean? Like, no one's doing it like him, and here, I'm really doing like a global picture. Girls and men, like, no one's doing it like him. It's like, he's like here to break the mold, he's here to break boundaries, and he's here to stay, I hope, you know? I really hope that people, like, pay attention to this because this is really, really good, and I cannot wait to see what he does next. Like, I wish he would just keep on releasing video after video, like, daily for me to get entertained and just analyze it, but this was great. This was very, very good, breaking the prejudice overall, and it's not only about the shock value, as I said, so that is really, really important, so that was pretty nice. What did you think? I want to know. And that concludes another video of Fifth for Tech, so I really hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, don't forget to hit that like button. You can also activate your notifications and subscribe to my channel, because that really gives me a boost to continue making videos like this. I'll see you very, very soon. Bye!